Hey everybody, PC Gamer Dad here with a new video that's actually an addendum to a previous video that I had on how to get credits really, really super fast here in Warframe. Um, so if you do this correctly, you can get in the ballpark of 550,000 credits per hour, which is ridiculous. So in order to do this, you do have to spend a little platinum because you need to purchase the credit booster, which is here in the market. Uh, so what you want to do is go into um, equipment here, go into boosters, get the credit booster here. I only buy the three-day pack at a time um, because you, if you have time to to play a couple missions over and over again, you're going to end up with literally millions. Um, don't waste your time. Uh, buying these stupid bundles right here, this, um, these packs where you can turn platinum directly into credits because this is an absolute fucking joke. 90 platinum for 30,000 credits is just stupid since you can pay the $40 for the credit booster and do this mission over and over again and get ridiculous amounts of credits super, super fast. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to the same spot, which is in Phobos, um, and this is the same mission that I did last time Actually, I'm going to cancel this so I can go solo because if somebody jumps in, they're not going to want to leave when I do. Um, so start this same, the Zayumga, Zayugma, I don't know how to say the fucking location, but um, this is a, a dark sector excavation. This is the same one that I did last time, but here's the twist. I said in the last video that you need to do three excavators and then you can roll, and it takes about eight minutes. Well... Um, as it turns out, you only need to do one excavator and then you can exit as long as you complete the first excavator. And you can still get the same amount of credits that you would if you do three or if you do 30 or if you do however many. Um, so I'm just going to run through. I'm going to do one excavator and roll and, tell, and show you exactly how this works. So, oh, this is in one of my favorite spots too, so this is perfect. So the first time I tried to do this, I timed it, but I didn't time it any time after that, um, and it was just a hair over three minutes, which netted me 32,000 credits. So if you do 32,000 credits every three and a half minutes or so, um, it ends up being approximately... 550,000 credits per hour if you have the credit booster on. So if you don't have the credit booster on, you can still um, get well over 200,000 credits per hour, which is still really good. Um, and it's still a really, really super fast way to get credits. Um, and yeah, this is, this is the fastest way that I know of. Um, you do have to have that credit booster, like I said, so if you can afford... Uh, the 40 Platinum, um, if you sold some Prime pieces or something like that, then that's really all you need to do in order to get the boost. Um, but I, I guess I should say, if you don't know what the credit boost does, it basically, not basically, it literally doubles all the credits that you earn from a mission. So not the credits that you pick up, but the mission credits that you get at the end, the ones that are guaranteed. Um, so... I didn't start a timer on here, uh, but I think it's only been about two and a half minutes now. Um, and we only have 10 seconds left on the excavator, and then we can roll. And I'll show you that you get the 32,000 just from doing one excavator. We'll see where the extraction comes up. Perfect, over here. Oh, and we get another 5,000 on top of it, so that's pretty cool. So let's rush here to the extraction. No need to mess with any of these. And you guys will see what I'm talking about. Super, super quick. Like I said, you only need to do one. You don't actually have to do three. Um, you do decrease your chances of getting keys and fusion cores and that kind of stuff like I showed you that came up last time. Um, but if credits is what you're after, this is the fastest way to do it. So that was about three and a half minutes. And you get the 32,000 mission credits. 
Um, as you can see, I have way more credits than I did last time I made this video. I have a ridiculous amount of credits. And if you just keep doing this mission over and over and over and over again, literally you're going to end up with millions and millions of credits with that credit booster. Um, so that is a caveat, an add-on to the, the um, video that I made before about how to absolutely get credits as fast as humanly possible. Um, you can, like I said, you can still follow this uh, formula without the credit booster and still end up with a hair over 200,000 credits per hour, um, which is still pretty damn good if you want to put um, a couple hours um, into doing that mission over and over and over again, which, like I showed you, is really, really easy. If you have a maxed out frame, all you have to do is complete one excavator and you're golden. Um, so. If you liked the video, hit the like button. Uh, make sure to subscribe. Lots more videos coming. Warframe Wednesdays every Wednesday. Um, you know, um, new videos coming. So hit subscribe. You know, um, and that's it for now. If you um, like, like I said on the last video, if you have ideas on how to get credits um, even faster, um, put a comment down in the comment section. Or um, if you like it or want to say anything, put a comment down there. Whatever. Um, this is PC Gamer Dad, and I'm signing off. Peace.